Welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube, here to help you break through fears and live an awesome life. I have got so much to tell you. Exciting stuff happening. We're going to talk today about those who have shall receive more, and those who have not shall lose what they already have. And I'm going to actually read that quote off of the computer because you know I'm always screwing these things up. Before I do that, I have to run my commercial my little ad, and that is these free videos that you see shooting out here are free videos for internet training. It's the information you'll receive of how do you start an online business, how do you change your lifestyle. I actually did it myself to create the kind of situation where I could write every day. We all want freedom, we all want income, we all want all these wonderful things, but you get stuck in daily life sometimes, right? And then nine to five, and then you're exhausted, and then what? Well, I took internet training, and I learned how to automate income online, and of course, I use it for all of my interests, like my books and my movies, and I've got so much to tell you guys. It's really awesome. I'll have those announcements coming. So, you can click on here anytime. When you know, even if those aren't jutting out, you can click on there, sign up for the videos. They'll come to your inbox. If you don't like it, you unsubscribe. All right, so let's get on to our subject. I'm going to read this. Got to put my glasses on. Whoever has will be given more, and they will have an abundance. Whoever does not have, even what they have will be taken from them. That's not fair. <laughs> I've had more people say, that makes no sense. Well, the whole premise of that and us saying it's not fair is the idea, the concept, that there is an outside power that makes those decisions as to whether we get something or not, when actually that entire whole statement is just based on quantum physics. It's not about what really exists. It's about how we think. So let's say you don't have much and you really aspire to be wealthy or at least financially abundant so you don't have to worry anymore. Even if you don't have money, if you are the person that believes that they have, now if I put the word believe in there, I'm going to reread that differently. Those whoever believes that they have will be given more and they will have an abundance. Those who believe they don't have will even lose what they have. It will be taken from them. If we put the word believe in there, then it might make more sense to you because that's your command to the universe. You're creating your abundance or not. It exists for everybody. There is no limit to abundance. None. You having stuff doesn't take away from somebody else. You having stuff doesn't make, make you e evil or greedy. It makes you an abundant person that can do anything you want with it. It's what you do with it that counts. It's your intentions. It's like, is it greed for greed, you know, or is it uh, abundance for good? Your own and for others, right? If the plane's going down or it's in trouble, you have to put that mask on yourself. You can't help anybody else if you've passed out. Go for the abundance. You were meant to be abundant. There were no rules that said we had to suffer. We create that. So what are you going to do with it? If you get the mindset that you have, that's where these all of these, you see these um, YouTube videos that say, be grateful. That's the abundant mindset. I have. Look at what I have. I'm abundant. Those who believe they have will get more. If you're going focused on, oh, I don't have anything in my bank account. I would like, please, abundance. I don't have. Please give it to me. You're in the I don't have mode. And what you have, you're going to lose because the universe is sending you what you ordered. I don't have. I don't have. Ooh, stress. And it's going, okay, here it is. You don't have is that's all that's all we heard. We didn't, you know, we heard the begging and the sadness. It's like, that must be what you want. Because why would you say anything other than abundance? I have, I'm grateful. That should be your focus. And that is quantum physics. Concentrating, focus, that wave turns into a particle. And it actually forms into cash. 
or a relationship, or a good relationship with your kids, or something turning around for you, or the awesome, perfect job, or the, the money that you need for your business, you know, the bank finally says yes, or whatever it is, it doesn't matter. If abundance came to just spiritual people, then Hitler would have never been in power. There wouldn't be billionaires walking around doing nasty stuff. But look at people like Bill Gates, who's doing awesome things to change this world. Even Elon Musk. Elon Musk doesn't have a problem being a multi-billionaire. He has no problem taking money for what he, he uh, invents or contributes or all the Teslas that he builds. But guess what? He's using that for awesome things. He's also creating things that will change our lives and creating this better world because of his wealth. He has the power to do that, and look what he's doing with, look what Bill Gates has done. Awesome things, and he does it for the right causes. He's not enabling people to be broke. He's, he's assisting people in rising themselves up. He's giving money to causes where they're teaching people to be, take care of themselves, or generating, you know, water or energy for themselves, and how to, you know, right? Teach a man to fish, he'll never go hungry. You give them a fish, half of these people don't even know how to cook. It rots before they can eat it. Unless you like sushi. All right, so back to the subject. Well, this is really the subject, isn't it? Those who have shall receive more and abundance. Who are you? Are you the I have or are you the I have not? You get to decide how you think. You're in full control of that and the universe co-creates with you. So yes, you are part of the power of everything out here that flows through you, you're connected to it, so it is actually you creating it. It's much bigger and it's powerful beyond our absolute mind-blowing imagination. Anything you can think of, it goes way past that. So. Are you limiting yourself? Are you focused on the you know, negative bank account? How am I going to get the money? The desperation, even the desperate, oh, I'm going to get the money, I'm going to get No, no, that is your signal to the universe. I don't have it, I'm afraid. Or, oh my gosh, I am abundant. I'm not, I do have a roof over my head. Even if you're living with somebody else, if you had to go in your parents' basement, you still have a roof. Thank God you have parents. I don't have parents anymore, right? My whole family's dead. Talked to my aunt yesterday and she said, wow, there's two of you left. My nephew and me. That's it. But I have my nephew. There are two of us. And I don't think I'm going to die anytime soon. Not unless something weird happens and I decide to exit. But I'm here because I am still going to give this message till my last breath. Because it feels good. I know I'm empowering you because you have the power. I have the power. You have that power. Christ said you had the power. Buddha said you have the power. Look at all of the prophets out there. It kept saying, hello, McFly. You have the ruby slippers on. You always did. You could have gone home anytime you wanted to. Instead, you had to go on the journey, and that's what we're here for. We have to go through the journey to realize that, and now you do. Are you done learning? Are you done learning? Are you ready to start implementing this stuff? I have. I'm abundant. I look around my house all the time, and I go, wow. Wow. By the way, this is a fraction of the size. It's a beautiful home. But it's a fraction of the size of what I've lived in. In fact, I think my uh, whole first floor could fit into the living room of the big mega house that I lived in. And my joy here is just off the charts because I am abundant. This is what I love. This is what I want. Everything doesn't have to be like some huge thing. You don't have to be a millionaire to be happy. You know, you don't have to have the mansion to be happy. Those things won't make you happy. Abundance is, are you happy? Joyful, are you? do you have the things you need and desire? Are you able to go do the things in life you want to do? Are you able to give to others because you have that extra money to share? Not because you're going to fix anybody. Let them take care of themselves. But when you see somebody who's really trying and they need a boost, 
You can help them, by golly, do it. We're not here to enable people. We're here to take care of ourselves first, and that is to be the best that we can be. That means to love each other, to quit judging, quit, quit criticizing, quit seeing the negative. It's an automatic human thing, isn't it? To see the negative. The I don't have, I don't have, they don't have, they aren't this, they are the, right? We do it all the time. That's that energy of history, that hundreds and hundreds of years of the negativity that could just snowballed. And we can stop it right now. I have. I have, and I shall receive more. I'm abundant. Thank you. It's okay to receive more. Yay. Bring it on. Write me the check. Because I deserve it. I give. I'm a value. I deserve it. Thank you. Thank you. By the way, I just have I, recently, I don't know if it's that Stuart Wilde manifesting. You see my candle back there? I've been doing it just to see what's going on. Woo. Stuff, huge stuff is happening. Huge. Do your rituals if you have to. I know I can manifest without that candle, but it's sort of fun. And so what it does is it helps you focus on what you have. And you say, I don't want, I don't, you know, please give me. You say, thank you. Thank you for this. I receive the money. I receive the $100,000 or whatever it is you want. I receive the awesome job. I receive the love of my life. Thank you. I am abundant. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And then you light your candle and you send it off to the universe. And here's another thing. Send light and love and prosperity out to the universe and healing. What you send out is you. It's coming back to you because you are that energy. I have and I shall receive more and abundance. Can you say that? Do it every chance you get. And every time that little brain of yours, that ego goes rant, 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 I don't have you, please send me, I deserve it. Why should I lose what I have? And that person who's wealthy is gonna get more because they're thinking different. That's why they're wealthy in the first place. They don't think like that. They're thinking, I have, thank you, yeah, let's go after, what, what else can we do here? Boom, boom. Can you do that? Yes, of course you can. Do it today. I'm sending you light, love, abundance, but you are the only person that can accept it and allow it into your life. Do it. You deserve it. Get all that crap, oh, I haven't been a good person, like how can I... Be? That's your judgment on yourself. There's no judgment on the other side. There's just a life review of you judging yourself. You don't have to judge yourself anymore. Just say, you know what? I've had a steep learning curve. I'm ready to change all that. I'm, I'm ready to be a kind person. I'm ready to be a, a solid mom or dad. I'm ready to put down the booze or the drugs. I'm ready to stop doing things that are harmful to this world and other people. I'm ready to stop thinking negatively because that hurts other people and myself. It takes me down. Just make that decision because you do deserve everything in life. And you make a decision every moment of your life as to whether or not you're going to be that awesome person that gives and makes this world a better place and in return will make you abundant and joyful and happy, not because you're going to get money, that's just going to be a, a bonus because you know that you're giving more than any material item can give this universe. And that is elevating your energy, raising your vibration to joy because it will affect every, every other entity and energy on this planet and beyond. Make that your gift to the universe and to yourself. You deserve it. You deserve it. Sending you light, love, prosperity, abundance. Abundance. Peace. Namaste.